Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I have the pup box for my puppy today. Um, last time I did this, I actually did it an unboxing with my puppy and my daughter and it was just a little crazy. Um, I was gonna try to do one with just my puppy and, um, and while my daughter was sleeping, but it didn't happen. And then today my daughter took the puppy to work with her because she works at a dog groomer so she can take him to work. You know, she usually takes him once or twice a week. And so I just thought, you know, I'm just gonna open it and show you because I wanna get this video done because I have a lot going on the rest of the week and I'm not gonna have any more time in the next like five, six days to record anything. So, and I wanna get it up for you. So, um, the pup box is $39 a month. If you do month by month, if you do a three month plan, then it's $34 a month, a six month plan, $32 a month. If you do a year plan, it's $29 a month. Um, I can't remember if there was like, I'll, I'll link it below, but I think when I started, I think when I signed up, there was like some kind of code. Okay, so if you use the code SUMMERLOVE, S-U-M-M-E-R-L-O-V-E, you get 65% off your first box with three, six, or 12. So 65%, that's a pretty good deal. That's what I ended up doing. I don't know if I had 65%, but I had some kind of deal like that. But I'll put the information down below if you're interested. And yeah, so, okay. I love this. I, I keep going back and forth. I kind of wanted to get the bark box, but because he's a puppy, this goes based on his age and the size of dog he is. And I like that. So maybe after he's a year and like full grown and stuff, I might move on to, um, actually he might be full grown before a year. He's gone pretty big. Um, I'll try to, I'll, I will try to take like a picture for my thumbnail of him with one of the toys or something. If I remember, <laughs> so bad, uh, I might not. Um, okay, so they have all kinds of papers in here. And so you get these on top and this is what's inside. Oh, that is perfect. They ask like, is your dog a male, female? Is it a large breed, small breed? How old is your dog? So let's see. So it has like all kinds of stuff. So it has the list of everything in the box. So it talks a little bit about them. Then this says ready to escape. Maybe your state is starting to lift restrictions. <laughs> maybe you are still stuck indoors maybe you're still in quarantine but trying to get a little more fresh air each day in the midst of this madness there are a few consistencies but the one thing I think we can agree on is that your pup is ready to get out and get moving as we head into summer months and the world begins to open up make sure to know a few tips and tricks that will make re-entry just a touch easier for you and your best fur end um, and then it has tips let's see re-socialize pack treats and water ease in watch out for fleas and ticks um let's see a quick note from the team pup box hey puppy family we wanted to say thank you to every pup in our pack we are so appreciative of our customers thank you for your continued business during these trying times we rough you that's cute so it has just information i'm not going to read every single thing but like tips and tricks and then they always give you this and this is laminated which i think is great i'm going to keep them all and then this would be a good gift for well not this but like somebody that gets a new puppy that maybe doesn't have puppy experience because look so uh my pup what's today actually the 23rd uh, Lincoln was born on December 24th so he will be six months old tomorrow so it says training and development for your six month old puppy so I've had one of these for each month that I've gotten this so uh, four five and six months so and it just gives all kinds of um, information exercise and stimulate uh, keeping uh, basic grooming, teaching puppy self-control, and it has just like tips, bath, hair, or, uh, hairstyle, cutting the dog's hair, I don't know, <laughs> paw, paw de cure, so cutting their nails, and then a guide to loose leash, wa leash walking skills, sit stop, you know, and a look inside the box. So I don't know, I like it because, and I think you can get more information oh no 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 
When you tell your friends pupbox.com refer, you get a free pup box and they get 50% off. Oh, that's cool. So if you guys signed up, you would get 50% off. Although right now, I mean, you might as well go for the 65% off because um, it's 65% off. But um, in the future, if I'll put my link, I'll put both. I'll put my link and then I'll put the code because I want you guys to, like, if you do this, I want you to get the better deal. Um, but if, I guess, if somebody refer, or somebody, somebody signs up under me, then you would get 50% off and then I would get a free puppy box. That's cool. Okay, anyways, I love these. I'm going to save these and then the next person I know that has a new puppy, I want to give them to. I just wish I had like one, two, three, you know, a month. I should contact the company. I wonder if I could buy the first couple months because I wasn't getting it yet. Okay, so there's always like toys, treats, and just other stuff, which is cool. It's not just toys because, I mean, we got like a whole basket. So the first thing we have is from Here Doggy Ultrasonic Toy. The ultrasonic toy only your dog can hear. It's a silent squeaker. Oh, I can hear it. Oh, it's a whale. That is the cutest thing. It's a whale, and then he's got a little blowhole, and it sounds like water. Or not water. Air. <laughs> that is so cute. He loves the squeaky toys. He'll get a squeaky toy in his mouth, and he'll just sit there and hold it, and he'll just like, rrr, 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 like over and over and over. So that's really cool. I don't think they, they don't have like a price, but yeah, I can hear that. Still, it's fine. It's quieter than the other one. Then, what is this? Well and good, tearless shampoo for puppies. Ooh, my daughter's gonna be happy. She's the one that bathes him because she works at a groomer, so. We got a tearless shampoo, gentle formula, effectively cleans without drying and irritation. It has purified water, coconut derived cleansers, aloe vera, polycoratinium, seven, fragrance, pearlizer, citrus acid, vitamin B5, vitamin E, cathon, CG and salt. Salt? Why would you put salt? Huh. I wonder how it smells. Ooh, it smells good. It, it doesn't it doesn't have like a super strong scent, which is good because some dogs might be allergic to stuff. Okay, then we've got a ball. Ooh, this is heavy. This is like, I guess I could show you. What does it say? Orby Tough Guru Interactive Treat Toy. This is like really heavy. It's like a, oh, oh, you put treats in there. Oh, what a good idea. It has these little slots. He likes taking things out of things, if that makes sense. Like they show right here. You put little treats in there and they've got to get them out. This would be good for like when we leave him. Oh, you put them in the middle too. When we leave, like if I have to go somewhere, I've been trying to leave him a little bit here and there because he goes everywhere with us and he goes with my daughter to work or he goes with me and I'm like, he's gotta be able to be home sometimes. So um, I had um, I had an appointment, oh, to do my hair. I couldn't think of what it was. I had an appointment, so I left him for a couple hours and I came right home and checked on him and he was doing okay, so I'm like, all right. Um, but he cries when my daughter leaves. He whimpers, like, he and he'll pout. And I'm trying to get that, you know, I don't wanna leave him alone a ton because I know that's not good but I want him to also learn to be left to home a little bit, just a little bit, you know, just if in the future we're able to go out to dinner, <laughs> you know, when we can't take them, which I mean, places are open up now, but I haven't, I've not gone yet. So anyway, so that's really cool. I like that. It's a ball and a treat thingy. He's gonna love that. Then we've got treats. We've got Blue Buffalo, which is a good, brand bites soft moist training treats and these are tasty chicken recipe and this is so funny <laughs> they gave a leash and it's blue and it's actually it's a nice like thick sturdy but I love that it has a pattern on the other side um what's we have our leash but he need I, I felt like he needed one a little bigger and actually his collar he's grown so much so fast that the other day, I'm like, honey, his collars, when I say honey, I'm talking to my daughter, because I'm mama and my daughter's mama um, when it comes to the dog. It's it's kind of like her dog more than anything. She's she's the animal person. Like, my son loves him. My, my little one loves him, but my oldest is the animal person. Um, 
So we're both mamas. But anyway, so I told her, I'm like, hun, his, his collar is getting tight. It's like all the way extended. He's grown so much and it felt, I mean, it, it wasn't choking him, but it was tighter than I like them to be. I like them to be kind of loose. And um, so we took it off and we went online or she went online and she found a really cute one and it, it has, it's like blue and green and it's a picture of the Aurora Borealis, which is like a um, bucket list thing for me. Like the, one of the top of my bucket list is to see the Aurora Borealis, the Northern Lights. So that's kind of cool. And so I actually think this will go, which we have and then, you know, we, and this is a little sturdier and thicker. So it's not, like they do, if I had like a Chihuahua, obviously this would be too big. This would be too big. This, you know, but they do it based on your dog. I have a big dog, and so they give me bigger toys, which is really cool. We took our dog um, to a rattlesnake aversion training because we live on property and there are rattlesnakes over here. I haven't seen one in a couple years, but there was one right, another person right over here, um, they had one I might have had two recently um, down by them and so you know I just if the dog gets bit by a rattlesnake that's like thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars in fact the vet was telling me if a human gets bit it could be like $150,000 to, to get you the antivenom and save your life and I was like dang I did not know that um, but so they did like the landlord that owns the property did he lets these this vet and this group of people come every year and they do an aversion training and they do it on the property because there's kind of like an area set up where they can they can do it and they can bring the snakes out and um, the snakes are real they're not harmed the vet because I was concerned about that the vet says he it's like a thin piece of tape um, over the uh, rattlesnake's mouth so that he can't open and bite you know and it doesn't hurt him doesn't hurt him when he takes it off or anything like that. And they use multiple snakes so that it's not, you know, one or two snakes for everyone. You know, like, even though they're just sitting there, they pretty much just put it on the ground and walk the dog by. And the, you're trying to get the dog to notice it and then to stay away from it. And then they had, like, somewhere they walk down further and there's, like, the rattlesnake scent and they're hoping they'll smell it and they're trying to teach them if you smell that you go away and then they also had a rattle sound and a skin a rattlesnake skin so there's only there's they usually do a smaller snake and a bigger snake but they do like multiple I don't know if anyone even cares about this but I thought it was pretty cool <clears throat> well anyways my landlord had said hey you know um, they have this uh, this rattle you know rattlesnake aversion training if you want to get it done and they have a rattlesnake vaccine but he couldn't get it till six months so we got that also and that's just you still if they get if they get bit by a rattlesnake it's still going to cost money but it's not going to be nearly as as much you know um so but yeah my landlord ended up saying you know yeah you can take lincoln and and I was like, oh, okay, what's it cost? And he said, no. He goes, since we let him do it on the property, you can do it for free. And I was like, oh, cool, you know. And then they told me that my landlord actually gave up his dog's training and gave it to my dog, which was really cool. Which his dog is uh, maybe three years old. So he's been doing it. And so he's probably pretty good. And maybe he's, he's comfortable with it. But I don't know. I thought that was really, really cool. So. I want to make them at like apple pie or something. I got a, a plethora of apples right now, so I want to do something nice. I just thought it was really sweet of them to do that, you know. Anyways, story time, I guess. <laughs> oh, that's something they say on TikTok, huh? Story time. I hate when they do that, and they're like, story time, so. And then it's like the dumbest thing ever, which technically, I probably just did that, huh? But I didn't do it on TikTok. And you guys already know I just talk about whatever. So if you don't like it, then you probably wouldn't be watching. Right? <laughs> okay, anyways. Pup box. Oh, look, they even have a picture of him. I need to update it. It says, this pup box was packed with love for Lincoln, whose birthday is December 24, 2019. Everything in your pup box is handpicked just for you. Thank you for being a subscriber, Lincoln. Um... And then notes, I can update this too, but I wrote Lincoln loves to chew and we're trying to get him to not bite when playing. 
which he, he's gotten a lot better. When he was like little, he'd always be biting, not really biting, more mouthing, but I don't really like that. Um, so he doesn't do it with me that much anymore. But, um, and then I had put this picture a couple months ago. I don't know if you can see if it's coming in clear, um, but he's gotten way bigger than that. He has gotten way, way bigger. I can't believe how fast this dog has grown. Okay, anyways, that's it. What did I say? 39 a month or 29 a month, depending on the amount of time. So again, we got a full size dog treats. These, these are like five bucks, I think, four or five bucks, because the brand. Um, this toy is gonna be 10, 15 bucks. Same thing, toys are not expensive. Same thing with the leash. Um, and then we got the shampoo. Last time I think we got like a bag of treats and then we had like a single oh, like bone type treat. Um, and then I think we had two toys. Oh, last time we got, it was really cool. It was like a water bottle and it flips over. And then when you, it has like a little thing that flips forward and this is the water bottle. Then when you go out and it hooks on your like, uh, hooks on something, like you put a, hook it on your pant pocket or whatever. So when you're out and about, you have it. And then when you use it, you just fold the water bottle up and flip this forward and it becomes like a little bowl for him. I thought that was really cool. I should have used that the other day. Okay, anyways, I'm done talking. I'm sorry. I keep going on and on and on and on and on and on. It's like you guys are going to respond or something. <laughs> All right, that is it. Thank you so much for watching and have a beautiful day.